Hi guys, welcome back to the gym. Gym leader Erica here, and this time we got a little bit of an unconventional deck. I'm sure you recognize it by now. This is Yoshi Tate's Wall with Wishy Washy GX, Celestia, and Zergatry, of course, for that nice, nice Lightning GX. And of course, this was slightly different. There's four hoop instead of three because I didn't have a Giratina. But the deck is looking good. I am someone who loves walls, can't even deny it. I have played Wailord for a very long time. I even played Wailord with Seismitoad because shenanigans. Which is actually probably going to be the title of this video. Shenanigans. But, you know, pretty basic stallist. Counter catcher to bring up when they don't want up in the active. Crushing hammers in order to discard some of their energy so it makes it harder for them to hit you. Enhance to get rid of those special energies. Field blowers, you only need one. Four max potion for the annoying heals. Two nest balls so I can grab what I need. Four puzzles, of course, because you can't. How do you play without puzzles? Parallel City. Four Acerolas. That I kind of want to tweak just because. Super scoop up. Super scoop up is not better, in my opinion. Two bridges to get set up because what deck doesn't play bridges anymore? Delinquent. Just gotta bring that. Hand count down so they draw more. Gladion, just in case I prize anything I do need, especially if I prize Zergatry or the energy. Two Guzmos, of course, to keep the switch up. Three Lucid means get back my supporters. Four ends as my only draw support. Two Plumerias. Three Skylas to grab whatever I may need. Fourteen Flare Grunts for, of course, that energy discard. This is my favorite card, guys. You don't even understand. I, I love Mill. I'm a terrible human being. But I just, I love it. I love it. And the card is beautiful. You cannot go wrong with Team Rocket. Unless you're going with Team Plasma, then you're just better. Yeah, we play four of those. Four. And we go through them pretty quickly. And then one Team Skull Grunt to discard the energy out of their hands. Discard their hands so we make them throw more later. And that one, the nice one lightning energy so we can use Circuitry GX. Alright guys, we're just gonna hop into some matches here. See if we can frustrate some people. <laughs> I know I should feel bad enjoying such a terrible, terrible style of play, but it's just so much fun. Like, it, it, there's a reason why I say shenanigans. It's literally playing shenanigans. The, the, the whole deck is a joke. I mean, it's got a, it's got a, it's got a good strategy. I can't speak like an old human being. It's got a good strategy in mind. I mean, be able to wall your opponent, especially when there's a lot of Zoroark around and they're drawing constantly. It just it lets you get ahead way more. We're not gonna go first. I'm gonna confuse my opponent. <coughs> and then die for a moment. Starting Hoopa, not bad. Maria. Not my ideal starting hand, but we'll take it. Now what are you playing against? I just said Zorark. It knows. See what he's gonna do with this. Test DC. Go ahead and nest ball. I'm just gonna grab another Hoopa. That's all I really need right now. To play a grunt and pass. There's not a lot I need to do, it's basically because after he evolves, he can't hit me. Like, Unless you get something else out that is a basic, or he plays, like, for example, the stand-in Zoroark, he can't really do anything to me. The GX! Give it to me. Give it to me. Trade away, my friend. Trade away. See if you can find something, because it looks like you're playing probably straight Zoroark. Because there's a Mew they tech in in order to uh, deal with Buzzwall and other fighting types. The buzzball is basically the only kind of time. Lele? What you gonna get? Oh. Forget. The forget. I'm willing to bet he grabs more Zoros. But I don't know if this is just straight Zorark or if he's playing at side tech. 
guys, it's Gardevoir. This is gonna be fun. <laughs> bring it. Bring it. I'm gonna lose this, but bring it on. I am literally sitting with Hoopa. That is, there's a reason there are no wishy washes out about. I think I'm waiting to put on the wishy washy. Push the counter, get rid of the energy, and pass. You see, the main thing he would have to do here is somehow shut down abilities, which doesn't do him any good. His deck is full of abilities. He's trading with Gardevoir, guys. He's looking for a breakthrough. Nope, he's... Why? But why? Are you working? I forgot Galate exists. Good job, Erica. Galate is a thing. Shuffling. Probably trying to set himself up for next turn. And trade again. He's gonna go ahead and end. He's on a 29 cards, guys. This is only like his second. This is his second turn, if I remember correctly. We're only on the second turn for him. Yep. Yep, second turn. Four cards and one is a double card list. Wait, let's get rid of that stack to you. Get rid of puzzle switch, ultra and a double card list. That is two DCE and discard right now. This is what we do, guys. This is how you play this. Mmm, luck. I love this deck way too much. I love the gambling bits. It's just too much fun. Way, way, way too much fun. Alright, it's premonitioning. What does he think he's gonna get? Okay, stacking his deck. Stack it good. Trade. He's drawing so so low. Dang, out of the DC. Does he have a way out? Oh, that's right, he hasn't played a supporter yet. But <laughs> it's gonna bite him in the butt. It is going to bite him in the butt. Because the moment he brings that up, all I gotta do is Team Flare Grunt, and then I can set up next turn. Because I can just put up another Hoopa, and he's basically out of DC. Here too. 20 cards, I mean, just what are you doing? Playing double puzzles or he's playing a single puzzle? Don't be double puzzles. I already discarded one of your puzzles. It was double puzzles. I should have known. What else would you set up with Mallow? I just got VC for next turn. Max me out. 260 for weakness. Takes one prize. This is why I just want to send up Celestila. I am going to go ahead and just knock off this energy, anyways. Because he is now effectively out of puzzles, unless he twilights. He has two DC left. He's gonna go swamp. Dang it. I don't know how many 
many plus this plays anyway. He had a switch in deck, obviously. I mean, it's not too bad. He's, he's, he's taking single prizes. And my goal is to take zero prizes. Pass. Because even if he brings up the Hoopun kills it, he still has to take two turns to knock out the Celesteela. Or choice ban. I mean, it still takes two turns, but. Please draw more cards out of your deck. 17. Ultra Ball. He threw away rare candy. Do you have another Arcani in hand? He still has his trades left as well. He didn't trade. Or set himself up with premonition. I think I have a way out unless I draw another Pokemon this turn. If only I got an impure cards. No, because each he, he trades he draws four. That will just put him at nine. gonna knock that out either way. Probably shouldn't ask Bald for something, but this forces him to keep drawing and I hope he draws low enough. Cause I mean he did trade and obviously he should stop trading, but he does need to play a supporter to take the knockout next turn if I can calculate correctly. Yeah, because he'll only do 90 if he doesn't do it both turns. <sighs> I have a little bit of faith here. He's got three DC and discard. There's a good chance to hand. There's four DC and discard. He needs two fairy. He needs two fairies. He has to double attach. Oh, you son of a gun. I didn't even think about that. <laughs> right, we're gonna play an even longer game, but I know he's putting in all DC. I 
almost wish there was a devolve option, but there's no real point because there's no damage on the field. I mean, he's played three rare candies, but he has to play Carlios. He put all the he put all of the energy in, guys. I like gambling with that way too much. I should have end. Limited this hand and drew more into mine. I need a Pokemon on bench. He went from like 14 left to like 10 left today. This not looking good and it's probably gonna go bad. to do this, but I'm gonna have to, I don't even get a Pokemon. It's gonna have to discard, well he's gonna discard the Lele obviously, which I brought the Lele up somehow. We're gonna go ahead and Heat Hammer. I'm crushing. <sighs> Alright, early is here. That was a mistake, I should've grabbed another Pokemon. Oh well. It was pretty dang close, either way. I don't really like Sun Steel in here. I know why it's in here. I know it's because its HP is massive, but... You can just play for Wishy Washy. But I guess it covers some of Wishy Washy. <laughs> yeah, he's gonna set the stuff up. That's game. Ooh. Bring it out, boy. Be your DC or whatever it is you're grabbing. Are you going to kill me with the Gallade? He's gonna kill me with the Gallade. Gallade literally gave him the game. <laughs> if he did not have that Gallade, it would have been game over. He couldn't hit around Hoopa. Alright. Lost! Yeah, but a fun game. Let's go into another one. Just give me something a little more. Give me straight Zorark. I want it. I do not know what's on the other side of the field right now. I really don't. Captain Crunk. That's not a weird name at all. Oh, nice and speaking person. Dang, he's not gonna mulligan. I wanted him to mulligan so I can see what it is. Obviously it's fire, but then also had electric and water. Which has me like, what are you doing? Mm. Give me that nice hoop start. Give him a better hand. Oh, it's Pikachu again. I shouldn't, but I want to know what I'm going to draw into. A Gladion and then a Hoopa. Let Gladion give me something that might be prized. I have no idea. I should have looked. That's the one thing I forget to do, especially online, is I forget to look. In an actual, like, offline game, it's so much easier because I'm actually, like, searching for things. This, I'm like, let me grab Pokemon, let's go. I, can, I gotta do this. I hope this is right to you, at least. I'm just glad it doesn't have the Patrice. My dude! We have the same idea! He's gonna- I'm gonna confuse him, but... Same! <laughs> same! The Gladion plays are good. Forgive me while I low-key play a Sun and Moon Wonderlock on the side right now. It's totally, totally not what I'm doing during a video or anything. You know, that's another bad thing is I have ADHD very badly. I have a very, very, my attention span is literally that of a child. 
I need like 50 different things going on in order for me to be able to concentrate on at least three different things. Which is why normally I have two games going along while I play this. Oh, I'm saddened. Why is this the deck? I mean, it's not really gonna affect me, but it hurt. It's hurtful. That's hurtful. Oh, but I got nothing out of it. No. Okay, he didn't get double rockets. I would have been insulted if he got double rockets. Draw you some more cards, my friend. Thirty-nine to forty-one. Let's do this. Let's do this. This guy's in the golden best ball. Keep that ball in. Flip teeny even got flip teeny. Flip teeny gaze. He's drawing so much deeper into his deck though. He's five cards below me. I mean, that's two rockets away, like if you hit it with double heads, but still. Quick attack me. Quick attack me or nuzzle me. Whichever one you want to do. Hit me, brah. This is going to be hilarious. Both of our decks are stall. Flash mill. Bring a scroll back out. Ah. Hey boy, boy, do it. Do it. I'm actually enjoying playing this. Why am I enjoying playing Mill? I don't understand. I'm enjoying. It's Mill on both sides. I should be like hating life right now. No. <gasps> he does the puzzles. Do it. Do it. Try to get me closer to you. Yeah. That does nothing to me though. That does nothing to me. I don't evolve. You're the one that evolves. Flipteeny gave you one extra flip. Good job, Flipteeny. Is it only on Pokemon yes? Yeah, for an attack. Think of a draw boy. Rude. I wish there was a flip teeny for all effects. Like, if I could reflip for rockets, game set match, I play this deck every day. That'd be dumb and maybe broken. It'd be so much fun. Real. Game is, I try to change the music. There we go. 
glitched, glitched any makes with remixes. Really, really good remixes. What are you getting? Where are we at now? You're 20. Boy, you're seven cars behind. What are you doing? Why you do? Keeps getting lower and lower and farther and farther behind. Rock is my dude. Guys, I'm getting help. He threw an N in the three N in the discard pile. I am hurt. That's annoying, because neither one of us is gonna take prizes. That's literally gonna be how I force him to draw more if he brings his hand down again. That's what put me ahead right now is the fact that I kept making his hand fall. That's how you flip double heads. That's how you do it. Correctly. Just keep increasing the deficit between you and your opponent with the number of cards remaining. That's how you win a mill mirror. It's too good. Plus, these Pikachu's are gonna do nothing for him. I mean, yeah, you paralyze me, but, um, I say, get him back, get him back, get him back. He just puzzles for everything. It's so good. It's hilarious. Come on, dude. I believe in you. Oh, he, can't, he cannot hit double heads to save his life. He really can't. He's seven cards behind. <laughs> he gets double heads on that, though. He can get double heads on heat more. Come on. But you, you're gonna pick double puzzles, or at least one puzzle. Did you have... Yeah, I took a puzzle and I took a rocket. I'm gonna lose me and grab rocket, grab it in, chill and pass. Cause I mean, we're, we're gonna sit here. This is how this is gonna play out. Is we're gonna sit here. Use seven cards behind me still. As long as I keep up the deficit, we're fine. Twenty-seven to twenty-two. If I hit any heads next turn, it's literally gonna kill him. Because he can't- he has to continually catch up and continually play Team Rockets. But in order to do that, you really gotta have complete guaranteed way to do that. And I mean, it's pretty decent because he has left Teeny out. He's got his freaking heat force going. I mean, he's gonna flip again here. He gets one hit, so he gets one card. Gonna grab a puzzle. I should probably just say that it's like the link with him. But that's how you do it, you play. <laughs> The deficit, as long as I just keep building up the deficit between the two of us, it's gonna- it's just gonna keep playing out like that. Like, he's eight cards behind right now. Take that back, he's nine cards behind. Born for flipping coins. <laughs> I don't know why. I think it's particularly this coin, because I play this with my buzzball and I almost always go sprites because it tends to flip heads a lot. I don't know why. I don't know if that's just me being silly or if it's actually occurring. Flip it again. You're gonna flip it again. If you fail it, I'm gonna laugh. Oh, he didn't. He's just gonna grab the one puzzle. Smart move, my dude. Said. I don't see him coming back for this unless he ends, but I don't think they play N in this deck at all. I think it's mainly, well yeah, I guess Cynthia, 
and that'll discredit his hand a lot, but he's too busy trying to get these rockets off, and he's just not hitting them correctly. Hey, not my rockets. Leave the rockets alone. They just want to discard your entire deck. I'm gonna focus in on my end. Flip it, Heatmore. Come on. Did he flip already? One head, one tail, just grabs that, yeah. Ooh, finally hit the double tails. Oh well. Why did loose me in this card? There's two loose means, I got one loose mean left. It wasn't in the prizes if I remember correctly. I mean, it's still a six card deficit. He has to keep rocketing, he has to hit more than one. Again, he just hits one heads. Slightly pause because while he does that, I'm gonna go grab the charger that I brought over here and forgot about. Because I'm bad and I forget that I left on the charge. Sadly, battery on this is not good at all. It's 3DC, and so if he has one in hand, he can keep going, but it's gonna take him a bit to be able to do that. Yep, in hand. I figured he's got a massive hand. Four card deficit. Hmm. <laughs> Rockets are on my side. I have two left in deck. If I grab the only rockets I had to prize. Unless I'm being dumb and I forgot that I saw one. Okay. I was on a DC. He has one card. All I need is the energy, and I had the energy at one point. Energy in the discard. There we go, make him play it down. Make him play the devolve. Shorten his hand up. This is how we do win. Super long. I didn't realize it was gonna be this long. I mean, I know I'm playing stall, but come on, my dude. Oh, oh, he did it. He might have just brought himself back with that. Let's remove the stack view so I can see what I lost. I still didn't even lose anything that important. I literally need a, I need a puzzle. I need a rockets. That's even better. Give them here. That puts two rockets in my hand. Gives me shit to flip for next turn. As long as he doesn't hit another double heads, we should be fine. <laughs> Keep evolving that thing, because why not? Because he knows by, uh... He knows if I put up the... If I use the GX, he's done, like... Two. Alright, not bad. If I have four, I put myself back in the heads. If I get two heads, it puts me back in the lead. And four does not have to hit another heads, or two heads to put it back on top. Okay. 
okay. We're almost even. Ten cards, nine cards. He's got a flood super well. Way too close. Yep, go ahead and paralyze me. You're good. You're good. Bring it on. I'm okay with that. And he did what I was waiting for. Yeah, that puts it back up to 16, but he's gonna play his hand out. He's gonna play the bullshit. He's gonna bring it down. Flip again. Now, if he doesn't have the pulse on his hand, he just, he just really screwed himself. He really did if he doesn't have it in his hand. If he doesn't take the puzzle right here, if he does, he probably has it. Yep, that probably gave the game. Because I don't see much I can do from here. I mean, I'm gonna play it out. I mean, heck, we're. <laughs> Is he six minutes behind me? Is he that slow? My dude. Well done. Well done. He's finally get it in. Does he realize I'm immune to defeat? There's, we're gonna play it out anyways. That's where I fuck. I just left the deck. He's gonna deck me out. I've accepted it. Yes, I do. I wish they'd stop switching that around. We still got four cards in hand. Alright, come on, my man. I shouldn't have put all these things out. That was a mistake as well. I should have just kept him in hand and put a hoopa out. He wasn't going to try and sit there and try and knock out a hoopa. Come on, do the four heads. I believe in you. I believe in the magic of the rockets. My guy. Just just grab your rockets. Let's do this. I have <laughs> basically given up one in the game. There's no way out. It's hilarious. Ooh! Woo! He did it! Well done. Well done. Wow. We're gonna lose all these games. I'm okay with it. Mill is just fun to crush. I shouldn't say it's fun to crush champions, but it is. I mean, all the deck literally does is force you to mill out. That's all it does. Like, we're gonna sit here while you get milled out. Unless you find a way to knock me out quickly enough. Alright, I like that start. This is probably gonna be. I wanna say Metal Zora, I can just be up to the sleeves, but I also didn't pay attention to what was in his deck. It's obviously we bought Zorak, but what what do I do with this? There goes a Lele and a break. No, we're not gonna play that. Yeah, obviously he's gonna hit me. That much is apparent. We probably gets to hit me because I have an ability. But otherwise, what are we doing, my friend?
be very hard to believe that he doesn't have it up yet. I mean, at least he can't play it lately. Bite you in the butt. I just changed the music. Why not? I tried to find my phone, see if my favorite was on here. Oh, the Anastar City remix that everyone waited for for forever. No, this is not Anastar. There we go. is out. So the other draw more. So I just gotta find a way to get to use a lot of the actives and put up a break. Obviously this one I stand in, so that's fine. He's trading, which is okay. I mean draw more for you dude, um that just gives me an easier way to take the game all year long. No, that doesn't have to that one to cross yep. But I don't know what I did, but okay, I'll take that. I don't know what I did to scare this man, but I'll take it. Oh no, we win something. Oh no, we didn't. I'm still like three wins away. All right, one more match because I didn't even get to finish that one. I cannot figure. Give it. I will kindly take it. And me. I mean, I'll take that too. That's not bad. Another Hoopa. Can't stand her. Put down Zerger Tree. So obviously it's gonna play special or something. I'll put down the Soul Seal too and then we'll pass. See what he can do with that. Go right ahead, draw more cards. That just makes it a lot easier for me. Right, it needs 
one energy to attack. Nothing I can do. I mean, he has no energy out. He paralleled me. He paralleled me. Rude. Give me a delinquent. Let me just discard that energy next turn. Thank you? I mean, just continue to do that? I'm willing to sit here. He is gonna knock out his butt. To 16 card deficit. It's not looking good for him unless he can fully pull out what he needs to. He has to build himself up more so than I have to build myself up. Sideways, I know what it does, but come on now. That's right, probably let you use any attack. <laughs> if he uses Blaster GX, then I'm. Why the fuck is that so hard? I don't. I say there was probably a thought process behind it, but what was the point of flipping over all your friends? I mean, tell Mavis that we don't play that anymore.
He's gonna be able to take the knockout TV. Or can he? Oh no, he chooses my active attacks. Put down parallel. Drawn to an end. Let me have top deck dreams. Or I'm gonna throw away the Mew and the Lele. Leave everything else. Yep, Mew. Come on. Yep. Alright, pass to him. You can grab the Hoopa knockout. You can literally either. You can use Lightning GX, guys. Wait, what attack did he use for Celestia? Did rock the ball, so he did not use the GX yet. Yep, back out. Got this. I don't really see a way out for me right now. Alright, unless I manage to draw the energy and I can throw the wires. Light lightning here. Yeah. Lighting. I keep saying lightning. I finally realized it's lighting. By the way, he should have this. I don't see a way where he doesn't. I mean, he's far down, but I have a zero. <laughs> mistakes were made. <laughs> a lot of mistakes were made. Do the lightning. Rumbling wires. Rumbling wires, discard the card. Yep, it's gonna take game here. Yeah, that's game over. Oh well. We lost three, but we won one. Plus, I really did actually enjoy that. I did actually really enjoy that mirror mill. I shouldn't be saying that, but it was actually more fun than playing something like this. Alright. Alright. Well, that, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video. Uh, let me know what you think of the deck. If you hate mill, would you play it? Honestly, I will, obviously. I'm actually considering it next week for one of our League Cups. It's probably a bad idea, but I'm at 88 points, so it doesn't matter. But uh, thanks for tuning in. Let me know what you guys are up to. What decks are you going to play for your cups? Down in the comment section below. And remember, the gym doors are always open.